Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel The Code Studio. So now list view is one of the most common widgets in Flutter and sometimes we will need to scroll the list view the top or bottom of it in your code. So in this video I will show you how to do that through one example. So before getting started with our code let me show you how it, it is going to work and look like. So on my screen I am having a list view and I am having two floating action buttons. So when I click on the down floating action button, our list view will automatically scroll down to the last part of our list view, okay, which will be your maximum extent. And if I click on the upward arrow fab button, so it will take you to the top position of your list view. Okay, so let's get started. So inside our code, as you can see, I'm having a stateless widget named home page. And here I have simply created one simple list view with a count of 40 list items okay so each list style is having a text of its index name as its center okay and we have provided some styling also which is like font size font weight and color okay now after this list view okay we are having two fab buttons so for that we have used the fab location attribute of our scaffold and fab button okay so we have provided the location which is center float okay and inside our fab button we are having a container containing a row of two fab buttons okay so when you expand it here you can see see inside this container we are having a row and in this row we are having our two fab buttons before getting to the code part of our fab button first we have to create a controller to attach it to our list view okay so we have we have created a scroll con controller which will be controlling the state of our list view okay now we'll get back to our floating action button so now inside our first floating action button in its on pressed method what we have done we have used our scroll controller and we have used its animate to method okay so what this animate to method will do it will animates the position from its current value to the given value so in this on press method what we want to do is we want to go to the last value of our list item we want to scroll down to the last position of our list view so for that we have used this animate to callback and here we have passed the scroll controller dot position to max scroll extent which will take you to the last position of our, of your list view okay and here with animation we are providing some duration and animation style which is curve okay here you will get other animations also like bounce in bounce out and others okay and in our second fab button all you have to do is just copy this control code and instead of max scroll extent what you have to do is you have to write the min scroll extent okay so after you will hot restart it, you will be having such a beautiful uh, scrolling animation inside your list view. So that's all for today. So I hope this uh, trick will be very much handy and useful to you inside your Flutter applications like chat applications or any other application which will be having the use of scrolling. Okay, so thanks for watching. Until then, keep fluttering.